Hello friends and strangers on the internet. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're checking out something very, very different. Very, very different indeed. Oh, got itchy. Um, today we're going to be checking out some a band. I think the band is called One OK Rock because it's in all caps. And I believe the song is Take What You Want. And this is a live performance at what I'm assuming is a Japanese tour, like a tour in Japan. I'm just piecing this together with context clues. Okay, friends, this link was put in one of my comment sections and I I was intrigued by the mystery, okay? I thought it would be super fun to just copy and paste the link, put it in my notes, and then like just click on the link, put the camera on, and see what happens. I just thought that'd be fun. So here we are doing that. Um, so um, I, I don't know what to expect. I'm kind of expecting like rock music because I see a guitar, I see a very large drum set. So I really, I don't know what to expect. And because this um, appears to be a performance in Japan, I don't know if it's going to be like Japanese rock or, or from from another country, if it's going to be in English or not. I really don't know. So um, let's find out together. Okay, let's go. Okay, so I'm I'm gonna go ahead and assume it's in Japanese. I'm I'm not entirely sure. I'm just making that assumption based on the few uh, bits and pieces of lyrics that I might recognize but yeah I'm gonna go and start over and let his he has a very beautiful voice I'm gonna go ahead and let him come back in again The memories, all the things we own. Not the picture of us on the wall. So take what you want. Okay, one thing I will mention, this this crowd is incredibly reverent right now, which means they have heard this band's music and they have been blown away before. So I feel like I am about to be in for a real treat. I'm kind of excited. I'm getting chills. Like, it is rare that you go to a live show and people are this quiet and reverent. You know what I mean? Like, it's, it's rare. So I'm, mm, mm, I, I want to like mentally prepare for this. All right, let's go. Ah, goosebumps already. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Is it playing? It's playing. Okay. Okay. We're just, we're soaking in the moment right now, aren't we? Here we go. Let's go. Can you hear me? I'm trying to hear you. Silence strikes like a hurricane. I'm singing for you. You scream it at me. 
It's hard to see your tears in the pouring rain. that was that was quite an intro was this the beginning of a show i'm wondering like was this the intro to a show because the way he just kind of like essentially just showed off his vocal ability before the song actually started i don't know i gotta i gotta go back and see that the light up and and the rest of the band coming and i gotta see that again ah this man's voice is so beautiful my goodness all right i gotta see the rest of the band come in with the blue lights know that whoever did the light technicals on this wanted those lights to look exactly like rain after him say after hearing him say like your tears are hard to see in the pouring rain you know it you know that that's the vibe they were going for and they nailed it ah. <laughs>
away from me um <laughs> i get the feeling that um that song was about the audience and the relationship the artist has with their audience i don't know why i just get that feeling and i think it was because of the performance i really love how it started off with him being the vocalist and him being like kind of in the spotlight but not really um, but like his, like, like vocally, he was in the spotlight, but he was kind of like obscured by the shadow a little bit at some points. So I thought that was really fascinating. I really like how the end of the song, he wanted the audience to close it out. And that's what made me, that's what really solidified the thought that like, maybe this was, uh, written about that relationship between him and his audience. And it was really moving and the performance was beautiful and i really love uh j-rock bands i haven't listened to many in a long time but that was really wonderful i would love to hear more from this band if you'd like me to react to more from this band please let me know um if y'all have never heard of this band and you really like that i'll put the original link in the description or maybe the link to the band in the description i don't know i'll figure it out later um this was a surprise reaction. I was not at all sure what to expect about that. So that was really, really fun. Yes, I will um, see y'all in the next video. Bye for now.